Jason here and welcome back to my fish room. So today we're going to be doing part two of how to build your own fish tank stands. So first off, if you haven't seen part one, you can watch that video right here. I really recommend that you watch that first before watching part two. If you have watched part one, here we go with part two. Lucky you can't smell things on the camera. <laughs> you can tell, could ya? That's the smoke, eh? Did we screw the other side or did it? Yeah, we did. Sam! Yee! Look at that. All three well, stands. Shells. Done. Take it's a while. 25 minutes. Look at that ass. So, went to Woolies today and do some grocery shopping and yeah, found some Smith's Chips Lamington flavour. Um, they smell real good, they smell exactly like you would think, Lamingtons, and uh, they taste awesome. So, here you go, Adam, have one. <laughs> mm. <laughs> yeah, good, eh? Aussie flavour. Yeah, Aussie flavour. Mm. Chef for Australia Day. Not bad. Not bad? Mm. I might take them. <laughs> he deserves them, he's done a lot of work today. Wouldn't be able to do this without his help. The stand's coming along really well. Got the first shelf in on the first stand. That second shelf's gonna go in now. And we'll keep going and we'll finish both racks today. Killing it. Okay. So this piece is actually gonna be the bottom piece, as Adam pointed out. So we use that shelving as the height for the first shelf to get the height right. So we sit it on that shelf. This shelf will be in the middle or top shelf and this will actually be the bottom shelf. Purely just there to raise it off the ground. Done. 
Adam's obviously got a bit of cleaning up to do now. He's gonna sweep, sweep my floors. I don't know why he's laughing. <laughs> but uh, it doesn't really take much of the fish room up. I am really happy about that. That's awesome. Yeah, it's doing nothing. And uh, these tanks will pretty much just run for the same amount of money that I'm spending on power at the moment. Because the room's already heated. Adam's head's in the way. So uh, there you go. There you go. So there you have it guys, my tutorial on how to build fish tank stands for your fish room. Now there's a reason why I didn't have you handheld like I usually do my intros. Um, and that's obviously because I didn't want you to see the finished product until the end of the video. And here they are, both stands painted, ready to go. Uh, it took me about half a day to paint both stands back and front and underneath. Um, the OCD in me wanted to paint the base of the shells all the way. Over it would have been obviously a bit of a waste of paint because you're never going to see these parts of the shelves uh, because the tanks are going to be sitting there. The only part you will see is uh, around the edges and in the middle here where both tanks are going to be sitting next to each other. So my OCD can't be that bad because I didn't paint all shelves. But uh, yeah, they're ready to go. So there you have it. Uh, that's the series complete. So I really hope you found this series uh, really informative. If you did, please hit the comment, like and subscribe buttons. It would really help me out and I'd really appreciate it. Alright guys, I'm going to wrap this one up now. Thanks heaps for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.